I have a bit of a confession to make. To me, bread is kind of a worthless food. It's basically like a lot of empty calories, and unless you're eating it specifically because you need the calories, there are a million better things to eat. My goal with food is usually to have some kind of nutritional purpose to it, even snack foods. That's why I'll generally eat pork rinds instead of chips, because you know, hey, an 800 calorie bag of pork rinds has 80 grams of protein. If you were going to eat a bag of chips anyway because you, like me, have embarrassingly little self-control, you may as well have the pork rinds to get a ton of protein along with all that sodium. I also uh, like to eat them with chopsticks because I don't like getting stuff on my hands. Anyway, bread. It's generally not worth it to me. But Hala is super, and we can make it with a boatload of eggs to help protein it out a little while making it rich and tasty. What I'm going to make might not really be Hala, according to the bread purists out there, so I'm sorry, I guess. Yeah. All right, here's what we're gonna need. Seven and a half cups of bread flour, two packets of instant yeast, five tablespoons of vegetable oil, six tablespoons of sugar, two and a half teaspoons of salt, two and a half cups of 90-ish degree water, 10 egg yolks, and one more egg for an egg wash later. In the bowl of a stand mixer, my college roommate Chris got us from our wedding registry. Thank you, Chris. We are going to put our water and yeast and whisk together. Then you're going to add your 10 egg yolks along with the oil and sugar, mix together again, and then add your flour and mix again and again. We're gonna put on the dough hook attachments. After a few minutes, you're gonna realize that you forgot to add your salt, so you're gonna do that now. Then after a few more minutes, you place on a floured surface and hand knead. You wanna keep on going until it's like this-ish. Uh, if the dough is too sticky, you can add some more flour. This was super sticky, so I don't know, maybe do like eight cups of flour. I, I didn't have enough flour to start with, it seems. There's a lot of dough here, so um, we're gonna split this into two. Place them in oiled bowls, cover them, and put them in the fridge overnight. It's the next morning, and I'm tired, and I'm wearing a robe. To show that time had passed. Check out our dough. It's risen. Leave it out of the fridge for another two hours, and make coffee using the cool as heck mug your wife got you. So one of them, we're gonna do a four-piece braid. The other one, we're gonna do a three-piece braid. Uh, I'm terrible at braiding bread and I guess other things that require braiding. So these look ridiculously stupid. We're gonna put an egg wash on them. We're gonna wait for an hour. We're gonna put another egg wash on them. Then we're gonna wait for another hour. Okay, and now we're gonna bake them. So preheat your oven to 350 degrees. Put it in for uh, 20 minutes. Then after 20 minutes, you take it out and you rotate it and then put it back in for another 15 to 20 minutes. Look at these, oh my God. They got so big, and they look so beautiful, and they're amazing, and they're eggy and delicious. Now, I ate, like, a lot of bread. Even though I ate a lot of bread, there was still leftover bread, and do you want to know what goes good with eggy bread? More eggs. Let's quickly scramble some. I like to crack them directly into the pan on medium-low heat, keep them moving for a bit. After, like, two minutes, start dragging your spatula across the pan, and you'll start to get little strips or, or peels of egg. Like like little peels of skin. Keep peeling that skin. Keep peeling that skin like it's the skin of a decomposing body that you hid and the police are never going to find. That kind of skin. Yes. Keep peeling. Keep things moving and eventually you'll have some nice creamy scrambled eggs. Toss that onto a slice of bread. Toss some pepper on there, but no salts because I'm trying to watch my sodium intake and then eat all of it immediately because it's delicious. Bam. Eggy bread with eggs, the perfect combo. All right, uh, it's that time of the video again. I'd like to thank my patrons, Marco Nicole, Chris the Chris D Daily, Daniel O'Brien, Shaira Drake. I'm gonna go with Drake this time because Victoria suggested it may have been Drake, so I'll go with Drake. Hopefully I'm correct this time. Uh, again, if I'm pronouncing something wrong, please let me know. Jacob Trenta, Martin Namiz, Clayson G. Samuelson, Dougie 18, Dischimera, and Jackie Destasi. Thank you.
It's important to remember to grease up your hands before handling your dong. This is what you married. I do.